Meet the ex-child celeb turned movie star, producer, writer and director. We may as well call the spry Seth Green a media mogul. Now switching scenes to adult animation, Seth's hooked up with comic buddy Matt Senreich over what they call their mutual geekdom to create Robot Chicken. It's um, a stop-motion sketch comedy show, and we lampoon pop culture and current events and all the stuff that we grew up with as kids. Do you want Miriam Dora? You in a crazy smile face, Miriam Dora? First you eat. Food is power! The power! Co-creator Matt reckons this crazy stuff is, well, just a day in the life. It's a bunch of friends just sitting around the table uh, just talking about what geeks talk about. And uh, it just kind of uh, spirals into what we end up writing about. Are you calling yourselves geeks? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Fly that flag yeah. proud. We are legion. Oh, my God. What's happening? What is this? Look at the size of it. Why did we bring it? There's such a diversity of sketches that people will find something that's their favorite. Something that I thought was absolute crap. Somebody insists to me it's the best thing we've ever done. Seth dishes out most of the voices. That's up to 60 per episode. But we can only afford five actual actors that do three voices a piece, and then anything that's left over, I'm going to pick up. How many voices do you have in your head? Not that many. <laughs> it's really, uh, you know, we have a lot of pitch. Uh, we play with pitch a lot. I'll be like, you use that one already. No, no, that's on, that's not funny. Not, not funny. Being on the celeb scene has its price. For a guy who's been famous longer than he hasn't, what's Seth's take on Hollywood's year of troubled stars? A lot of people, especially a lot of the young girls, and you can blame whatever element it is, but you really need a, a strong support system around you if you're going to let yourself get caught up in this industry and any kind of potential celebrity. Well, one way Seth Green hit Idol Icon was through playing the character Roz in the Buffy the Vampire Slayer TV series, one of the most studied shows in the world, and one of its biggest stars wouldn't rule out a spin-off reunion. I so treasure that experience that if we had the opportunity to resurrect it in a way that was sincere um, and valuable, I think I'd jump at the chance. But back to Robot Chickens for now. You can catch the series from March 11th on the Comedy Channel.